This week's Mugen Mondays is brought to you by Perez Play, an event and talent company specializing in all kinds of events, geek outings, and parties. Good morning, everyone. This is Ron Chet, aka Instant Dude speaking. Welcome to Mugen Mondays 112, and I'm playing a screen pack called The Queen of Fighters, created by Yui Sakazaki. If you've seen um, my project video called The Women of Cosplay, this is the screen pack base I'm using. And um, it's private, so The Women of Cosplay will never be released, and yes, it will be real cosplayers. But unfortunately, the project will take much more longer to do so. So basically, it's a, it, it's a hentai uh, project I'm doing, but the Queen of Fighters, well, it's just, it just a starter's pack. So I gotta set up my controller. You know, like a Sega Genesis controller. Yeah, press F1. No, press F2 to set up the controller, and, and yes, the, the control is already configured, so I have to input the math, it's just like the Sega Genesis controller, since that's a control I'm using. So basically, the Queen of Fighters is not the main episode I'll be doing, but yes, the screen pack is not the main episode, but I'll give you the main episode in a moment. So this, this is your basic so, um, stage selection screen. Yeah, just give me a mo moment to open up um, Naroku's uh, move set. Yeah, there you go. So this is Cherry Bugumi. That character exists, but she's actually ripped off from Yuyuku from Toho. <laughs> Trey Bugumi is an AI control character, you cannot play as her. <laughs> Shit, she's spamming that move already. Oh man, no, 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 no. Cherry Bugumi beat me very quick. Oh man, come on. Shit, I can't even block it. And yes, Trey Bugumi is one of the cheap characters. Damn it. Well, basically, this is what I'm showing you anyway. It's nothing special. And now I should talk about the Queen of Fighters from um, Sean D93. And Sean D93's um, Queen of Fighters is already giving me problems. Well, first of all, um, if you um, click on the Mugen um, execution file, you notice immediately that it, it gives you an error message. But even if you change it, and what it's intended to, you notice that the life bars and all that shit is uh, missing. But um, unfortunately, in order to play um, the Queen of Fighters by um, Sean D93, you have to click one of these batch fires, which is bullshit. I never heard such a feature like that. And believe me, it's not supposed to happen. Also, when you boot the game, it's on fucking full screen. I'm 
I never played any of the games in, in full screen at all. And you know why I don't play games in full screen? Because my computer actually crashed after playing full screen. So basically, um, three, three years ago, um, my computer crashed when I played games on full screen. So I, I'm not gonna um, do much about this game, so... You know what? Fuck it. Let's go to watch mode. The Queen of Fighters by... Sh John D93 is not a hentai game. Thank fucking lord. Yes, you can pick three characters at once. Characters they choose from. Hmm, even Julie, huh? They, no wonder they have sexy Julie in the, in some hentai games. That's Nina from um Tenken. I got some news. Um, um, recently, there's a Mega Man X hat called Mega Man um, X Generations, but I'm not gonna talk about that game during this will be Mega Man. So, yes, sir. Three, go. <laughs> wow, life about this game is the um, it, 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 it's just the stage. I haven't even played the, the whole the whole game, so I'm not sure if I want to play the game or not though. And single matches probably more more different than um Yeah 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 it's probably different. It's the sisters three choose from, but yeah, there's so many batch options. Yeah, well the gameplay is kinda like um you know Marvel vs. Capcom series. Actually Marvel vs. Capcom 2, it's it's a game you choose three characters. Yeah, the music in this game is kind of cool, though. So this is um, the Queen of Fighters by Sean Z93. But you may think that this might be the only game, right? No, no, no. Sean Z93 actually made a sequel of this game called The Queen of Fighters 2. And believe me, this is. This programming is much more worse than the previous one. Why? When I click on the um 
the executioner file, it'll take that long. I mean, what the hell is going on? The well, normally it'll take about a minute to load everything, but nope. After 10 minutes or 20 minutes or even 30 minutes, the game actually froze. So there are bugs and glitches that need to be fixed. And yes, it is a fucking issue right now. So this is the Queen of Fighters 2. Also, when you boot the game, it's on fucking full screen. Because it's... It's about to load since I have to click one of the batch files again. I gotta make sure to set up my controls. Up, down, left, right. A, B, C, X, Y, Z, start. No, I will not save. This time I go to arcade mode. This game got 10 matches. Or, 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 or 12, I forgot. But what I like about this one is it actually has a bonus stage. There are certain characters that go in specific order. I wonder if they have Sakura, um, uh, uh, Kasugano. Oh, yeah, there she is. Pressing the A button. So, I'm gonna play at least one, one match. One match throughout the whole round. And I hope I can beat the whole damn game. Maybe I should have put the game on easy mode. And look at that voice. I mean, this game is this program like, um, like broken music. But it also got, uh, a, like, like a, a, a first attack display or stuff like that. Or a danger display when a cow is. Dangerous. But yeah, throughout the whole game, it got a it got an announcer voice, which, which clearly came from a Capcom versus um, SNK. You notice um the top of the thing when it says computer level four. Well, each time um when you pass level three, the the, the computer level difficulty increases. This guy be fancy up the server Sakura, right? Thankfully she is wearing pants. Thankfully, but otherwise. Why the hell you create a a, a, a game that is not hentai? Blossom. You know, I should have thought about putting it on easy. Um, playing a game on easy, it kind of makes my life easier. But, but seriously, I'm quite good playing as Sakura or Kasa, Kasugano. Yeah, I keep like, doing the pronunciations wrong. Yes, 
Yes, she was. Yes, she was. She was all six foot. She's a six foot in Canada. Yes. I want to talk about 2017. I live in New York City and yes, Waterford's Liberty City Anime Con. The tickets are selling fast. They're up to six thousand. I think three thousand. I gotta double check. I think it's three thousand people pre-registered. So I gotta get in shape. I gotta get those tickets as soon as possible before they sell out, or I am not be able to go. But. I'm also gonna cosplay as um nobody ever cosplayed before. So if, if you're planning to go to Liberty City, you will see my cosplay. And there's a new anime convention called Anime New York City, which takes place at Javits Center. In 2017, I should go to these two anime conventions. Yes, you see that? You notice about that? Um, the ranking, um, the points, system. These are great programming. That's something I've never even seen in a mutant game before. Still on level 4, but when you play in um, level 1, yes, I, yes, I should beat the whole thing. The, um, the minimum you can ever reach is a uh, level 3. Yes. Yes! Here we go! I don't know... Yeah, I haven't practiced the soccer much though, so, but at, at least I got the rhythm. First attack super finish. Yes! I'm doing good! Yeah, great! Oh, she missed it! Woman named King. Us. Of course, um, the computer's getting harder because she's not level five. There you go. Fuck! 
I never press no, no F key buttons to I never cheat my way in. No, I can play it fair. The, the, the way that the offers are tend to be designed. continue this is the game queen of fighters 2 i reviewed all queen of fighters um and so far the screen pack is only good but these two games by sean d93 they're quite good but the problem is that the way they load it up is a piece of dog shit this is ron chen aka it said do it speaking and next week well, it better be Star Wars Rogue One, right? Here's, here's an interesting match, because um, it'll be Fox McCloud versus Luke Skywalker. Interesting, right? Thank you for watching. Take care. <laughs>